when he gets track and when he gets some levels, that can set up kills around the map for the Meepo. And here we go. First, First blood attempted blood. by Cloud9. They're going to strike. They barely get it. The trade oh. highlight dies there. Almost made his way out. Nine. And they could be looking at a lost lane of Rex. No, it comes the Meepo. The follow-up is here. Say hello to Mappo. He's brought down Rabbit. Almost killed him off. Lin low. Not dead yet. That's just your Aegis and Lin survives. One more right click. The Shuriken finishes the job. Now DDC on the back foot. Chaotuji hexed up, then gets doomed. That means Centaur out of the fight. Will they pursue out the Bane? And it looks like they might get some track kills as the trade. They eat up the Bane in the end. He will fall. And well, it's three dead. Some track gold going Cloud9's way. And they do hold the base, at least for now. Are they going to get one more? Looks like Sing Sing might get the net. Yes, he will. And the silence from Bone. It's four kills. They're still pursuing DD, but Envy has no stomp, no blink. So and this as, is I, as I said, the moment... Hazardly peck away. In comes Sing Sing. They found out Lin. He doesn't have his BKB yet. He'll get defensively slept, but it's only for a moment. Then they doom the Enigma, so there's really no way out. No stampede to get them out safely. And now Cloud9 begin pursuit. DDC nearly bought, brought down. He'll go for the TP out. He can't find it. The four step connects, jams it in. And now they go for round two. Centaur looking to make his way out. He has a BKB, but he's tracked and he's slowed for ages and ages. It just doesn't have the damage to finish the job. Now Yao could be next. Envy. Well, gets a, gets juked, then the blink TP. Well, at least make it out, but I think once you stampede and use grip there, you just gotta chill. You can't force it. Time and Sing, it's too late. Sing will they wanna jump in now, can they check the Aegis? In comes the black hole, the follow-up's there from Rabbit, and they snatch the Aegis. The turn is real from LGD. The Meepo's down. LGD find their opening. They knew it was coming, but they couldn't stop it. Cheese on the pit. Now Lin, well, he's doomed. He's trying to stand his ground for the time being. He will go down. They lose the Aegis, despite giving it up. They've lost five, and now with the Aegis bringing him back to life, they'll lose him again. You got Meepo, but at what cost, LGD? It's not a good trade. That was like the best. Meepo's not here yet. They may poof in. Oh, the e -blade, the e -blade, but, the follow -up, but it's a nice black hole canceled by a net. It was one second on the BKB from DD. He didn't have it when he went in for the hole, and it cost him his life. And now they look to get out. The Doom retreats. GG. Checkmate. Do you have to ban Meepo in the next game? That's I like. I I really like this GG call because for me, Radiant LGD victory. just lost control of the map. And as I said in the previous series, it's a best of three. If you lose a game, you don't want to drain yourself. You don't want to waste energy on playing a lost game and get upset about it and get all negative. Reset, go next game. And this was a great pocket strategy from Cloud9. They're using this. They want to secure themselves to get into. Uh, or get themselves a good chance of getting into the winner bracket. Of course, it's not certain after this one, but then they would get to face DK for that.